Hi guys, Angie Bell with my fairy treasures. I'm coming around. Hi guys. Okay, it'll be just a second. Let me get myself in here. Oh my goodness. My little corner here, and then I have so much yarn everywhere. It's like crazy. Okay. All right. This is my second time starting this video because I had the wrong yarn. I bought in so much yarn that I got confused with the bags. I had the wrong bags. And I called myself not even going to do this this year. I think I bought more yarn, more yarn this year than I did last year. And last year I went crazy. Let's just get started. But in my defense, I will say I only pretty much only buy yarn one time a year. And that's how it's been for like the last three or four years. I just do this one in June because... I go nuts so there's no need for me to buy too much more yarn for the rest of the year I really much pretty much don't okay let's get started all right oh and um, after um, I do have um, another haul after this another giant haul of yarn I told you I went more nuts I think than last year okay let me get some out. Just a second. Okay, is that all of those? Damn, I bought a lot of these. Jeez. Okay. There's another one. How many of these did I buy? My goodness. All right, good. Here's my readers. I'm like, I need my readers. I bought, they were only a dollar twelve. That's why I bought so many of these. Plus, I liked it. One, two, three, four, five, six. How many did I buy? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. You know what? Sorry, I didn't buy twelve. It, this is two different yarns, <laughs> and I'm making it all just one. Okay, I was like 12 skeins. I don't normally buy 12 skeins of one thing. I'm like, what was I doing? Okay, yeah, I didn't buy 12. I'm like, that's a little much. Um, I bought one, two, three, four, five. That sounds more like me. I usually buy five or six skein. Okay, this was only $1.24. Let me show it to you. Isn't that pretty? It's a like a pretty blush pink. I think that is gorgeous and it's super 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 soft and let's see what the particulars on it you guys you know what my glasses are I got my glass cleaner right here I need to clean my glasses I got my glasses they're my readers and I don't really major glasses they're just readers but still just a second let me I mean they are nasty dirty I can't see a darn thing out of them all right, let's see if that's better. Oh, so much better. It's amazing what you can, how you can see when your glasses are clean. Okay, let me see. The particulars on this is 100% polyester. Um, it's 169, 169 yards, 100% polyester, uh, US 9 knitting needle, and uh, US 10 crochet hook. So, and I picked up five of these. And it's so soft, you guys. I would love a sweater out of this. I have a sweater. It actually even has holes in it. I love this sweater. It's just a fabulous sweater. It has holes in it. Uh, I bought it, I think, at a thrift store even. Anyway, it feels like this. So, uh, hopefully five of these is enough to make a sweater out of because I want to make a sweater out of this because this feels so good against the skin. Okay. Next, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven of these. And I picked up seven of these instead of just my four, my five or my four. Well, I usually don't buy four. I usually buy five, maybe six. The reason I picked up one, two, three, four, five, six, seven is because these were only $1.12. I mean, that was really good. So um, it's, um, let me show it to you. It's a, the, a velvet yarn. Isn't that gorgeous? how pretty that is 
I love it. And it's super soft. Really, really soft. Oh, I just love it. Okay, so, um, oh, let me show you. Because you know what, what irritates me is when people don't show the ball band on that last one. Let me show you the ball band. Oh, and I didn't tell you the price of this. Okay, let me get it together. This is the um, ball band, so you know what to look for. This is the one I just showed you before that I want to make the sweater of. That's what the ball band looks like. And it's um, yarn B. The price, the tag is right over it. And it was regularly $4.99 for $1.24. And the color is called clay. So that was that. Now this one, I just showed you the color. Again, it's yarn B. And there's the ball band. And the reason I think it's important to show the ball band is so that people know what the brand is and what you're looking, what they're looking at. Anyway, um, it was regularly $4.49. I got it for $1.12. It's Velvety Smooth Erin Pale Blush is the name of it. Um, let's look at the, the particulars. Yardage is 161 yards, 100% polyester, U.S. Knitting, uh, knitting Needle U.S. 9, Crochet Hook, U.S. K dash ten and a half I never know what I'm talking about when I say these number for crocheting because I knit but I'm sure you crocheters know what I'm talking about so I got seven of these and this is so soft I would love to make like a boho cardigan out of this or a sweater it's beautiful it's so soft okay <clears throat> next two three Four, five, six. Okay, so then I got six of these. Um, this is so soft. This is yarn B again. Uh, so there's the there's the uh, ball band, and that's what the color. Look at how pretty that is. I have this color running through my hair through my hair extensions that I have almost this color running through it. Isn't it gorgeous? And I just think it goes really good with my skin tone. So this is beautiful. It's super soft and you can see it's, it's shiny. It has that shine to it. But what is that brand that has the shine to it? I can't think of the name of that brand of yarn, but I love how, sh how that, that sheen it has to it. Okay. So, um, it's so soft. Oh my gosh. Okay. Yarn B soft secret. The color's called tobacco. Um, I bought, it was regularly $4.99. I got it for $1.24. Awesome. And the particulars are how many yards? 300 yards. What great yardage for the price. Oh my God. 100% acrylic us for knitting needles, us size seven. And, um, where's the crochet hook? That's weird. I don't see a crochet hook size. All they have is knitting on here. That's weird. Anyway, girls, you can figure it out. It's 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 um, it's just a medium weight yarn. It's just a um, a worsted weight. So, um, you guys know what you guys need. What what crochet needle you need for worsted weight? So, okay. And I picked up one, two, three, four, five, six of those. Gorgeous. That'd be another gorgeous sweater. Or a shawl. Or a bow. Or a um poncho yeah okay next is this Catalina oh Katarina yes good I'm glad I got some of this Katarina I keep seeing people get, uh, get this Katarina and I'm like that's gorgeous and I I don't think my store had very much of it and she marked it down in front of me so Maybe I have more of it in another bag. I'm not sure. So far, I only have three of these, of this one. So um, let me show you the colors. These are gorgeous. Or I think, you know what? I think these are the only these are the only colors I actually really liked. No, they had them all. I just, these are the ones that I liked. Or this is the one that I liked. Isn't that beautiful? It's super soft. Look at that. Gorgeous. Such beautiful fall colors. This is what the ball band looks like. Okay, it was regularly $3.99 and I got it for 99 cents. It's it's Yarn B Katarina Tanga Topia. I don't know. Okay, um, particulars on this is 
295 yards and it's a knitting needle size six. So that size six is a little thin for me. That's probably why this was the only color I got because I don't like knitting with like a six or a knitting, a knitting, a size six knitting needle. I like nine and up, but anyway, um, I could hold it double too. So I probably will hold it double to make it more worsted weight. Um, Okay, so knitting needle size six, crochet hook size H8, and I have three of them. And I'm sure three is all they had, because I would have picked up more. I would have picked up, you know, five or six or something, so. But I think three is all they had. You know what? Holding a double, you know what would be gorgeous? Because this color is in there, I believe. That would be pretty. Put this with it in there and hold it double what I'm probably going to do when I use it. Okay. <clears throat> I think I got some of this last year, so this will be kind of nice just to add to the stash of what I got last year. I think. I'm not sure, but one of the ball bands came off. Okay, so um, I got... I love this yarn. Um, they're worsted weight. They didn't have... Uh, very much of this on the last two years they haven't had very much of the I love this yarn worsted weight um, on clearance they didn't have much last year either year before they did but isn't that gorgeous you guys oh Rose Likes Crochet I know you like this hey girl <laughs> you guys go watch Rose Likes Crochet she's awesome I love her um, she just had she just did a nice really nice big huge um, Hobby Lobby uh, Clarence Hall. So go check her out. And she has a bunch of other great stuff. So go check her out. She's awesome. Um, okay, so again, here's the ball band. Okay. And uh, it was regularly $4.99. Got it for $1.24. And the particulars are 100% acrylic. What else we got going on? Yards, $1.96. Um... Dang, they could not make this any smaller. I don't even know if I'll be able to see it. It's not just the print small, but it's black on gray, so it's like hard to see. I'm imagining because this is worse to wait. I know the knitting, the knitting, the knitting needle. Oh my god, the knitting needle size is probably a nine, so I, I can't see it on here. So it's probably nine because this is worse to wait. I think it's a nine or an eight, something like that. Okay, so I picked up one, two, four of these. So, four of those. And this one I got one, two, three, five. Three, or oh, maybe six. Six. I won't take all those out, let's leave them in there. So, I got six, this is I Love This Yarn again. And then look how beautiful. Isn't that pretty? It's like blacks and grays. It's really, really pretty. I almost didn't pick this up because I thought it looked so basic, but I'm like, you know what? That's gorgeous. What are you thinking? It's not basic. It's beautiful. And then here's the ball band. I love this yarn. And you guys know I love this yarn. It's so soft. Just so soft. Oh, love it. Uh, regular $4.99 and got it for $1.24. And then you guys know the particulars already. 100% acrylic and a US 9 knitting needle around, I believe. So, I can't read the, I can't read the thing on there. Okay. Let's put all of this away. Just a second. And then I'll grab my other bag. What I'm looking at is, um, I'm just thinking about my uh, thumbnail, so I just want to leave out some yarn for my thumbnail. Yeah, I'll leave this out. That'll look good. All right. All right. Let me grab.
grab my other bag down here on the ground. did I get? Oh, good. I got a good amount of... Uh, oh, okay. Yeah. I remember now. I did get a good amount of these. Oh, jeez. I got a lot of these. I'm glad I got a lot of these when I show you guys this because I got some other ones where I was only able to get three and I can take this and mix it with that. It's something that I got in, in, in another haul. So, I'm actually glad that I bought as many of these as I bought. Because there's this one, um, oh, I'll just show you. Look how beautiful this is. Isn't that pretty? Up the camera. It's pink, gray, and white. Yeah. It's real light. Very pretty and super soft. And I got something else that looks similar to this, but I, I wasn't able to get enough of it as long as to get three balls. It was if I want to do like a boho cardigan out of it or a poncho. But I got so much of this, I can mix it with that. So I'm glad that I picked up a bunch of this now that I did it. And I picked up one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I picked up nine, which is really obnoxious. But like I said, now I'm glad because I can mix it with the other and I'll have enough with my other one. So perfect. Um, and I probably picked up this many because it's a dollar twenty-four. Regularly four ninety-nine. That's what the ball band looks like. It's um Baby B, my sweet love. And it's so soft, you guys. Look how pretty those colors are. Love. $4.99, got it for $1.24. Okay. Um, here's the particulars. The color's called Bella Blossom. 92% um, acrylic, 8% polyamide. Uh, 94 yards. US 11, so it's nice and chunky, which you guys know I love. So this is perfect for my boho cardigans. Um, US needle, US knitting needle 11, and then the crochet hook is what? MN 13, or it says nine millimeters. So I guess you guys have millimeters and numbers on there, I guess. Okay, so there's that. back today, which I shouldn't have. Um, I didn't get this yarn today. I got this yarn on Saturday, I think. Yeah, I think on Saturday. And the other yarn I showed you guys in my last haul, I got on Friday. But anyway, I was thinking, um, I want to make these, um, these ponchos, but lightweight ponchos that have, a, that look like a, like, they look like, um, like late, more like a, look very lacy, very, the holes are very open. So like more of a lace stitch. So, and, and I want something simple, because yes, I love simple, and I can make them with the cotton, I thought, for like, and since it's cotton, it'll be really nice and lightweight for the summer, plus there's a lot of holes, because you knit it in that lace type of pattern, and so I went back today and got a bunch of cotton, so, but on this haul, I got, I got some cotton on Saturday, so this is some of the cotton, and my next haul, you'll see all the other cotton that I ended up getting because I want to make these, these type of lightweight ponchos. See, it has, I don't know what that, I, I don't know what that blemish right there is. But anyway, that's the poncho right there. Aren't they fabulous? And you can throw them over anything. Like you could be wearing a tank and a pair of shorts and throw one of those lightweight ponchos over it. Just, it's just like, you know, a little, almost like a fashion accessory. So, um, it's not to keep warm. It's just, you know, something cute to put on, you know, and I love wearing those. So I'm going to, um, that's why I went ahead and got a bunch of cotton. Um, and it'll be nice and light for the summer. 
or end spring. Um, Joanne's Web is where I got this from. So I copied this from Joanne's Web. So if you guys want to go on there, um, Joanne's Web, you guys can get this um, pattern. And it's called One Piece Shawl Poncho Wrap. Quick and easy. So that's where you can go get that pattern from on YouTube. Plus, you can watch then watch a video on how to make it. So it's really super simple. It's making one big like rectangle, I believe, not even a square, a rectangle. And the way you fold it is how it comes out like a um, triangle shaped uh, poncho, lightweight poncho. What is she calling it? She's calling it a one piece shawl poncho, but very lightweight. Okay, so this is perfect. I'm glad I bought these yesterday. I was thinking washcloths when I bought this, but I'm so glad I picked up this many. One, two, I got one, two, three, four, five. So I picked up five of these. Look how beautiful. It's this beautiful pink. So I love this cotton. Super soft. You guys all know we love it. And um, this has a sparkle in it. I don't know if you can see the sparkle. Isn't that pretty? Oh, I just love it. Um... Let me just look here. It's 97% cotton and 3% metallic polyester. And that's the metallic part of it, but it's basically all cotton, 153 yards. And did I show you the ball band? That's the ball band, 99 cents is what I picked them up for. Um, and they were regularly 379. So I picked up five of those. So I'm glad I got those five because I think this would make a beautiful, one of those lightweight poncho shawls for the summer. Oh, gorgeous. Or for spring. Beautiful. You can even wear it in the winter because you can wear like a total like wear something long sleeve and throw that on over it just as like an accessory type of poncho. Love it. Okay, I picked up two of these. When I went back today, I picked up more of these because this is a great deal. Look how big this is. This cotton. This is um, Yarn V Sugar Wheel Cotton Solids. And I love that, perp that lavender purple. Isn't that gorgeous? That's pretty. Um, regularly $5.99, got it for $1.49. Like I said, Yarn V Sugar Wheel Cotton Solids. It's called Lilac, Lovely Lilac. And it's just 100% cotton. Uh, 335 yards. So, you guys. I don't know. Maybe one, one and a half will make that uh, lightweight poncho shawl thing I showed you. So, I'm excited about this. This is going to be gorgeous. And it's so soft unbelievably soft and we're almost done I can believe this okay um, how many did I get of these I picked up quite a bit of these because you don't get very much uh, yardage but I thought it was so pretty that I just I had to pick up a lot of them Okay, I picked up how many? One, two, three, four, five, six. Six of them. Um, look how beautiful this is. Let me just show you the colors first. How gorgeous that is. Isn't that pretty? And it's super shiny. And it's super, super soft. And there is the ball band. You know what to look for. Yarn B. And it's a color play Blazing Sunset. Uh, regularly $4.99. Got it for $1.24. So that's why whenever it's a dollar, I just pick them all up pretty much. Um, the particulars. Oh, upside down. What are the particulars on this? Uh... 60 yards, so you don't get very much yardage. I mean, I don't mind with chunky, because this is chunky, getting 80 yards, because that's about average 80 yards, 80 to 100, when um, you're talking about chunky, because you don't need as much, because it's chunky, so it, it, the, the, it's going to work up a lot faster. Um, your project is. Um, but it's 60, 60 yards, 100% acrylic, knitting needle size 13, see, so... It's going to knit up so quick. You don't need as much of the yarn, you know. Um, and it's a uh, crochet hook size 
M or 9 millimeter crochet hook. Okay, I don't understand you guys' numbers and letters on these crochet hooks, but crocheters, you guys know. So I did pick up one, two, three, four, five, six of those. Okay, and lastly, I went back today and picked up more of these. So you'll see that in the next haul. I picked up more of this right here, I'll show you guys, because I think this would be great to do one of those lightweight, lacy looking ponchos I just showed you. I love this brown color. It's a brown and a beige. I love brown. I love browns and coppers. So I love that. So, um, and then you guys know the ball band. I love this cotton. And it's still the same particulars, uh, 94 cents. Was the other one 94 cents? Yeah. Um, regularly 379, 100% cotton. And is the yardage the same? Let me just make sure. 153 yards. Is that what the yards over here was? Yep, yards are the same. Everything's the same. 153 yards. And then um, I'm looking uh, US eight for the the US eight for the knit and needle size. And crochet hook is a nine. That's what it looks like. I can barely read that. It's really small. So you guys, that is it for this um, yarn haul. Um, I mean, this is it. This is a ton. This is all I should have done in the first place, but oh no, I have a whole nother haul over here waiting for you guys to see. Crazy. Um, but like I said, I only buy yarn once a year now. I just wait till the Hobby Lobby clearance and then go nuts and then I'm done for the year until next year. But I am, I decided I'm going to commit to once a month because he will always go, Angela, please do a video on what you're making. Because I'm always working on something. I knit like in the evenings. So what I decided to do is when I wake up in the morning, I knit for an hour in the morning and then I knit an hour in the evening, like when I'm watching TV. So I can get two hours of knitting done a day. So at least six days a week so I can get a lot of knitting done. And plus I need to knit a lot because I have a lot of yarn. So. And um, also, that'll be like I'm always working on something. I'm always completing something. So at least once a month, four to six weeks, I can come on and um, show you guys what I've, what I've uh, accomplished or what I'm working on. So um, that is it. Yeah, that's it for this one, you guys. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, I'd love for you to do so. If you can give this video a thumbs up, any comments or questions, leave them below. Come visit me on Facebook and Instagram. Come join our group. It's called Our Magical Little Place. If you knit, crochet, mix media, junk journals. It doesn't matter what you do. You can come there and share. You can come there and get inspiration. Um, on Sunday, um, it's Angie's art party. Um, I'm usually doing some, I go live. It's called, I go live. It's called Angie's art party. I'm usually doing some type of mixed media. Um, and everybody else is usually crafting, arting along or just doing the dishes and watching the show. <laughs> and then we have a, um, giveaway cup, two giveaways usually at the end. So come join us on Sundays. It's every Sunday, two o'clock Pacific time. Okay, you guys, that is it. And it doesn't matter that you, if you only knit and you don't craft, you guys just come, just come and have fun. Just come and talk. Everyone's just talking and having a good time. Just, a, it's just a place to gather. <laughs> okay, you guys, that's it. I will talk to you guys in the next video.